What is up you guys? Welcome back to my channel and if you're new, my name is Meryl and I make reaction videos. So, Happy New Year! Um, this is the first reaction video of 2023 uh, and I'm so excited because it's another DPRE and song so like all my social medias clearly I've been getting very much so into him and I think he's really fucking dope. Um, <laughs> yeah, so we're not gonna hold back this reaction, I'm gonna say what's on my mind and what I feel. So yeah, um, if you haven't already, please consider subscribing, leave a like, comment any recommendations you may have, and follow my social media so I'll be linked in the description below. Uh, thank you. Um, so the username is over again. Thank you so much for the recommendation. Um, so yeah, um, I'm in my leisure suit and I got my Koya headband. Let's go. Let's get it. So that's what the inside of a men's restroom looks like. from the jump, it looks very familiar and what goes inside my head. Yeah. Um, we can explain that another time. So, yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's continue. Interesting. There's a lot going on and like I don't think I'm gonna catch every single thing, but interesting so far. Thank you. Pause. I literally have the same glasses, but like I don't I don't wear them on video unless like I have to when like I'm having my really blind days. Um yeah. Sorry, that was so off topic and like not relevant to the video and I don't know why I said that, but here we are. <laughs> Alright, let's continue. Man, to really be flicking them off. Oh my god. Literally flicking them off. Like no blueberries in my ice cream cake. Oh, I just realized that like, captions were on. <laughs> okay, let's continue. No air to breathe with that masking tape. Stop, please. I need a hostage free. I need a rocket ship. I need a run from. I like no blueberries in my well, ice cream cake. Well, wait. Okay. No air to breathe with that masking tape. Stop, please. I need a hostage free. I need a rocket Wait, oh my god, wait. Visually? Honey, oh my god, stop, wait. Skirt! <laughs> Let, let's, let's pause for a second. Clearly, because I paused the video. But, um, I don't know, but like, this is why, like, personally, I say that DPRE is quite comforting to me as, like, you know, someone who, in a sense, has a disorder. You know, like a mental health disorder. Um, because, you know, if like you're watching this and like don't really like have the same wavelength or like, how do I explain it? It's just like basically if you don't quite understand what's going on by like watching, you won't get it. But like when you kind of have something in common with the artist who's creating all these visuals, it makes sense to you. And for me personally, this makes a lot of sense to me. All right, let's continue. Oh, 
in your eyes, baby. Red, green, all blue. Welcome to the other side. I keep losing my temper for you. I love it how you think I'm always this cold. Excuse me, while I bang. Man's acting chops are just. I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I literally, I, I've always wanted to say this, like, especially like when watching like the other music video. I think I watched So Beautiful, which is requested by my lovely friend Zessie Taro, who is also on YouTube. So you should go check her out. Um, yeah. Um, oh my God. Also, quite a beautiful, beautiful thing. I love him. Okay. But <laughs> like, okay, off like reaction things. I have been checking out his work. I have like, you know, listened to a few interviews here and there. Um, I think that's why personally I vibe with him as a person and also with his music because it is very relatable. Uh, at least for me right now, because right now I'm like, you know, on a, you know, going towards a downward spiral, but it's okay. We're gonna be okay. So, um, but there are like songs where I like, I think and look back and go, dang. You know, <laughs> okay, I know this literally had nothing to do with your video, but like, like, you guys, this is literally my anxiety in visual form. I, I don't know how else to explain it other than like, that's, this is literally my anxiety in like visual form. At least for me, this is how I relate to it is through my anxiety. So yeah. I'm just a fool to your eyes, baby. Red, green, all blue. Welcome to the other side. Christ, hold up. Let's cut to the be go back to the beginning of that because, like, a lot. And, like, for me, literally, this is how I see, you know, like, when my, you know, disorders kind of like, you know, all kick my ass all at once. This is what I see. I'm not even kidding. Like, this is exactly what I see. Wait, right here. Right here. Because not only do I see it, I see myself, and that's crazy because it's literally me, it's literally all me, which is like what it is right here. That's crazy. My bestie, I don't trust you pointing the gun at me. <laughs> I love you, but like, oh my god. All right, continue. This is literally my friend picking me up when I'm having a panic attack. If Kim is watching this, Bessie, I love you. Or Jennifer too. Jennifer, yeah, you, you know, I love you. I love both of y'all. We're like this. <laughs> She's in love with me and that's a drug and dangerous thousands. I love with your poses. Can't see straight, can't focus. Get chills when I see your old face, you the colors. Cowdice. Cowdice. Right, I like no blueberries in my ice cream cake. No air to beat with that masking tape. Stop me. I need a hostage free. I need a rocket ship. I need a ride. Bro, that's so scary, but at the same time, like, I get it. Oh my god, oh my god, are you guys gonna hit it? Oh my god, wait! Woo! Well, that's crazy. It's like, I don't know, like, like I said, if you, if you have, um, you know, searching, like, disorders, this kind of, like, will make sense to you. It's just, like, how I transitioned from, like, you know, having everyone around you, and then, like, when you start going through your whatever, you know, disorder you have, it feels like they're not there anymore. It's just you and whatever you're dealing with. And like I said, for me personally, it's anxiety and my depression and a bunch of other things. But like, um, we're not going to talk about that on this channel because I have actually talked about this on my, on the NAMI channel. So if you guys want to check that out, let me know. I'll, I'll link you. Um, so yeah, um, and then like when you finally like snap back into reality, this is like, this is like, 
a perfect representation of what it's like to have, you know, any mental disorder and like how once you go through it and then snap back into reality, it's like, well, what the heck, you know, where am I? This is it. This is literally it. So when you think it's almost over, I got this pill to make you come up. So now you blown on your covers. But yeah, he's like so when you think it's almost wounded. That's crazy. I got this bill to make you come up. Because okay, okay, <laughs> okay. I think I'm kind of getting the the gist. So see how he was wounded and like in the beginning he wasn't. At least for like this scene, I think. Okay, I might be wrong. Let me like go back just to be sure that I'm like not seeing. That like my brain is actually functioning like a normal human being. Hold on, Masties. I swear to God, I know what I'm doing. Oh my God. Hold on. I swear to God. Give me a second. Yeah. See. Well. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I was right. Okay. My analysis was right. So, sorry. I did confirm that. Like I was seeing what, what I was actually seeing. Um. It's like, oh my god, okay, so, let me explain, okay, when you're, you know, you start out like fine, right, which is how he started out, like physically looking fine, and he, he's fine in general, but like, that's not what I'm trying to say, <laughs> sorry, my intrusive thoughts are winning, um, <clears throat> so, he starts out physically looking okay, right, and then, like, as he's going through the, um, <clears throat> going through what he's going through, he ends up, like, back into reality, but is wounded physically. Now, when you have episodes like that, you do feel winded, you feel wounded, you feel tired, you feel all these things. And, like, sometimes, like, even though it's just, you know, all as they would say all in your head you do feel it physically and i think that this was a perfect representation of like feeling it physically because he um he actually shows it visually and i think that's really cool because um it kind of gets you to kind of understand what it'd be like for someone to go through like a severe disorder and yeah um i like how he um uses that to like create visuals to like and it also like helps like people that you don't quite understand understand and it make it would make a little more sense to them and personally for me i love him <laughs> so yeah um you know <laughs> you guys i really personally enjoyed that video thank you over again um i know that's not your name but like that was like the username i saw and like yeah um, you know Alright, um, I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction. Please consider subscribing, leave a like, comment any recommendations you may have, and follow my social media, so I'll be linked in the description below. And if you're in the LA area, um, I will be attending a army paint day. And if you guys would like more information on that, I'm hoping that there's still slots by the time I upload this video, but if not, um, yeah, it's, so it's going to be happening on the 28th of January if you're in, in the LA area. It's going to be in Redondo Beach. So yeah, let me know. I'll, I'll send you the invite link and yeah. Um, see you guys in the next video. Bye!